Welcome back, little video was short, but well, probably good. And yeah, bit late on the schedule, like one day late, but you'll know why. So, first off, hope you're all doing good, and let's show you the new model, which are actually 3D printed. You can probably guess what this actually is from the design. And yeah, the camera angle might be terrible, but you can probably have a little guess of it. If you know what the handle is, you can probably tell where it's from. Maybe from the uh, title of the video. But yes, you can probably tell that it is the Abyss Watcher's knife. And you can see right about here the camera focuses. If you can roughly see it right here, you can see there's a little indent here. This is all made in Blender, obviously. But if you look a bit more closer on the camera, little grains pick here you can't get in that's because because when i first glued it together this bit this right over here was actually like this on the handle so imagine this bit over here and that's how it looked so it would look like a little cleaver here so i had to get a tool cut it right here keep on cutting 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 Cut, 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 all around, pulled it apart, cut a bit more, started smoothing it. Then it took me about like 20 minutes just to glue it together again. And that was obviously annoying. As you see, the paint I've used was a bronze copper-like paint. And as you see, it's black plastic underneath, which shows that it's like a wood texture. I then use a grey and white to make it look well metallic ish for the blade it looks black still but there is touches of grey as you can see so this can obviously tell you what everything is about it and pretty good so let's show you the other thing which I may work on more let's see where is it this will be one this one's actually quite big so see and lower it in here we go you can obviously tell what this is when i glide it along and i'll tell you all about the etchings and see right in the middle it is kind of terrible and i do say it on my part because um little modeling problem this is in blender the subdivision this bit here was smoothed in like around so how to cut it in the middle and smooth both ends off and yeah it kind of looks terrible if i could i would make a new one but well you obviously know the reasons we have the thick chunk blade then we have the nice handle if i get the camera right about here there we go explode so you can see the color coating as i try copying it of what it is you can tell what this area is on the well, when you look at images of it, and you see the silver with a bit of black for the handle, which is quite nice. Obviously, I sandpaper it down to make it smoother, and honestly, quite a good grip. Same with this, though. This is quite a good grip as well, because if you hold it like this, I'll show you the camera, it looks good. So, yeah. Short little video just telling you all about it, but yeah, yeah. Hope you enjoyed it, and well, obviously after this bit, I'll show you the full size of them. So yeah, hope you enjoyed, and I'll 